It's kind of like we, we almost finish each other's sentences, kind of. Well, I mean, I don't, <laughs> I don't think we've ever finished each, each other's, other's sentences. sentences. <laughs> 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 Una muchacha chula de Chihuahua me vendió una machaca. Una muchacha chula de. Sightseeing.
Look at this. Rare footage of Johnny Bravo's son waiting at the airport. Look how out of breath he is. Choosing the right face to make in your selfies must be exhausting. Look how fast he went through three different face alterations. This is expert level influencing we just witnessed here, folks. You got the traditional portrait look. You got the, eh, I'm thinking of trying it in my butt, but I'm nervous look. And then you got the classic duck lips. Three rapid fire selfies, all within a two second window. Just an incredible display of skill. This guy's like a modern day cowboy, the fastest selfie slinger in the West. Meanwhile, this girl's horrified. You got onlookers filming you. And you got Jack White back there looking like he just came out of solitary confinement. What a scene. And you're oblivious to it all. See the look on her face? That's the look your friends and family make when your selfies show up in their feed. In all seriousness, I know you're trying really hard to be cool, but someone in your support system needs to step in and tell you the truth. It doesn't matter how many holes you have in your jeans, how many tips of hair you frost, or how many times you wear sunglasses indoors. As long as you're doing that, no one will ever look at you and say, now that guy looks cool. Never. It'll never happen. No amount of duck lip selfies or photos with your mouth half open will ever lead to admiration. You know what it does lead to though? People filming you and up Uploading it to the internet, which leads to people sending it to me. And that's not something to strive for. Imagine. <laughs> like wondering why everyone's staring at him. 